Welcome back. Now, imagine eating nails and screws for breakfast. Hard to imagine, right? Well, you just might be. Chemical Kim is here to show you how to remove the metal from your next bowl of cereal. And, girl, what are you talking about? That's right. You know, when you're eating cereal, oh. <laughs> you're actually eating nails, Tara. Can you believe that? No, I don't, believe, yeah. I don't believe you. Yep, yep. And we're going to show that inside cereal, you do have metallic iron. It's crazy, crazy. In all cereals? In all cereals. Like, huh. On the 4th of July, I brought in some iron and I, and I burned it, okay? And iron is ma magnetic, which means it's attracted to a, a, a magnet, which okay. I have here. And I just showed this real simple demonstration with burning, you know, can you believe that's what we're eating? You know, something that you can burn and it will spark and make pretty colors in our fireworks. But <laughs> that's what we're looking at. Just kind of oh, like, wow. so instead of, I mean, if you're in a rush in the morning, just take some, you know, nails and chew them out, you know, on your way to work and you're good. <laughs> We have iron in our body because that's what's in our blood cells and that's what carries the oxygen. This is about three to four grams of iron inside this. This is the amount of iron that a normal healthy human being has. So you're saying that it's okay. It's, it's okay, okay that we're eating this in our cereal. It's okay. totally good. Glad we got that. So I'm going to show how we get this iron out. It's really, really, really okay. simple. You're going to take a whole box of cereal, put it in a blender, which I did, and then okay. it, pour it out and you'll see. You can take this box, go ahead, here. Pour it out into the bowl, and you'll see this blended okay, so you blend, cereal. Okay. See all that iron? Do you see it? No. No, you don't, do you? But no. we're going to try and get it out using the properties, this physical property of metal, um, using a magnet, the magnetism. Okay. Then you're going to add water and make a slurry, and your hand gets to be the spoon because... Okay. All of this? Go ahead. Yep. Okay. Go ahead. And this pulls the iron, separates it from, you know, of course, the cereal flakes. Okay. And... Here you go. I'm going to give you this, this magnet, and what you're going to do is just move it around. And this might take a few minutes, um, but what you, <laughs> you're pulling that iron right to that magnet because magnets are, you know, attracted to iron. Doesn't that feel good, Tara? It's definitely a sensation I don't know if I've ever felt before. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that fun science? Yeah. Isn't that going to be fun kids for kids love this, to for do sure. that? Oh, yeah. Oh, for sure. And how interesting it is that you are drinking metal. Okay, so, so like I said, it'll take a few minutes, but I think you probably have a, at least a small amount of iron on there. Okay. So dip your hand in this water to rinse off your hand in the magnet, and then just kind of shake it a little bit. And I'll wipe it off. And I don't think I'm going to be wiping off any of the iron because it's so attracted to that magnet. And you will see, now it's a really, really, really small amount because your body, when it says 100%, you know, iron, your body needs about, depending on you know, your age and such, but your body needs about 8 to um, 18 milligrams of iron. So and you see is, that? Oh, yeah, you there's definitely that? some on there. Yeah, that little, little bit of iron. I know you guys can't see it, but it's, right it's definitely there. Yeah, and when kids do this at home, a whole box of cereal, you'll get that little piece of iron. Amazing, wow. amazing. Now, like I said, your body, yeah, eats, you know, you're, you're putting this metal, and in your body, you have in your stomach hydrochloric acid, and that hydrochloric acid breaks down that iron into iron ions that then goes into the production of, and there you're burping, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, your body will break down that iron for usable iron in your system for making red blood cells. And it so how long, how long do you suggest that kids do what I was doing before when they're yeah, trying to Yeah, probably about a, a good two minutes at Two minutes, least. okay. Yeah. yeah, I mean, you could continue and just pull out, I and mean, we already pulled out a good, good amount there. And that was just after that was just after seconds. Yeah, exactly, exactly. So, you know, and a couple more boxes would get you more iron, and then you can play around and make those, you know, fun little face shapes on um, transparencies. Oh, weird. But do you see that? How yeah. it's Turn, attracted? See if they can see that. Go ahead. See that moving around in there? And that's a physical property of, of iron. It's magnetic. You pretty much are the coolest science teacher ever. Isn't that ever. fun? Yeah. I love that. Yeah, love really that. cool. Yeah. Kids will love that. Kim, yep. you're eating. As always, metal. you rock. Thank you for Thank being you, here. Thank you, Well, you can find more activities from Chemical Kim on our website at WZZM13.com under those Take 5 links.